Growing up, I was the biggest fan of Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. That show came out way before I was born, but I'd watch all the reruns on TV. And so you know I'm not capping. I got the Bel Air 5s right here. But it's being harder and harder to be a Will Smith fan. At every opportunity Jada gets, she's been embarrassing him. She said that her marriage to him was the worst thing she's ever done. That the wedding day was the worst day of her life. Then he threw her a birthday where he stayed up all night. And on a national interview with him, she said... It was one of the worst events ever that it was all to push his ego. His good friend Chris Paul made a joke and she looked at Will like, you're not going to do anything about that. He goes up there and slaps his good friend and says, keep my wife's name out your mouth. She then goes on to say, go on to an interview and say, we've been separated for seven years now. So what are y'all then? Roommates? You telling me he was calling you his wife? Slapped the dude for it, and she's like, nah, we're just roommates. We're not something special. She said she was horrified of his actions. Then she comes out a few days ago, and she's like, Tupac is my soulmate. Then she's like, I used to sell crack back in the day. He's skipping that line forever now. That that line has been wiped from the existence of history. It was like, she said, I'm shocked that... Will called me his wife because we haven't called each other husband and wife in a long time. I didn't even mention all the entanglement stuff. This is not how it was supposed to go down for the Fresh Prince. I was the Fresh Prince with Nia Long. He was stunned. That used to be the Fresh Prince at least. Oh yeah, and she said Pac wanted to marry her when he was in prison. Is nobody, nobody. How many records you sell? I don't care how popular you are. There is no comparison. None. I don't know when they're ever will. I pray I never get stuck with somebody like that. 